five, four, four all. Whatever. It's time to win. And you're not going to get there by pushing the ball around the court and let somebody do it to you. Come on, play the match on your terms, not on her terms. Come on, this is why we're here. All right. This is why we play these matches. So when you get to these matches in the spring, you're going to do a better job. Let's finish right now. Come on, let's go. Antonella, you know, she can really help us this year. It's just getting a consistent effort from her day in, day out. And that's what you go through with freshmen, you know, especially someone coming from another country. There's a lot of adjustments she has to go through, and you kind of got to be a little more patient with the freshmen. But, you know, what she has to understand is we're going to, you know, we're going to have to really depend on her this year, and she's going to have to grow up quickly. And, you know, she did a good job. Probably didn't close that match as quickly as she should have, but, you know, at the end of the day, she came home a winner playing, you know, the way we want her playing. Yeah, singles was really good. You know, we really worked hard this this week in singles just as far as just our baseline play and just really making sure that we're doing a good job playing high percentage tennis, hitting the right shots, but playing aggressively at the same time so we're imposing our will on our opponent. And we, we did a better job of that today. I think Hannah's still battling out there, but we've won five of seven off of Ball State, which, which was good. And I just like how our girls – collectively played in singles. They competed really well, and you know we had some good results to match. Yeah, we got off to a pretty sluggish start in our first doubles against Dayton, and, but we snapped out of it pretty quickly. We, we did a really good job against Xavier, taking, um, I guess it was two out of four, winning the number one and number two positions. And You know, it's just so much of doubles, it's just, um, I guess you got to make a statement, and with these sets going so quickly and playing no ad, you know, you just, you got to, do a good job quickly, you have to execute, but it's just relaxing and having fun. And, you know, these girls are going to play so much better when they're not putting so much pressure on themselves and they're enjoying themselves more. And we, we definitely, we were a totally different team um, against Xavier and doubles. You know, so much with these girls. It's what's, it's what's going on between their ears. You know, I mean, we just want them comfortable out there. Well, I'm happy out there. Well, I'm believing in themselves. You know, we want them positive. And look, tennis is a sport. There's a lot of ebbs and flows to what goes on in a match. But, you know, I just think our girls, for varying reasons, they either want it too badly, but on the bad end, we're not focused enough. But, you know, we just got to just be a little steadier and manage our emotions better and just always compete. I mean, no matter what, you know, Coach West and I, we told him today, look, we're not that hard to please. You know, we really are. But, but when you're not giving it 100% mentally and the effort's lacking, the energy's not there, that's just a bad recipe. I mean, you're going to lose. I mean, we're just playing too many good teams this weekend on our schedule. We got to be ready to go every single day. And that's what's great about the fall because you have some setbacks, but, you know, it's, it's nice to learn some lessons in the fall. But this is stuff that absolutely cannot happen once we get going in January. And, you know, look, if, we can be the team we were the second part of today, you know, looking into our regular season. You know, we're going to have a good year, but it's just every day is a new day, and that's what our girls got to understand. And, um, you know, we just want to see, we want to finish strong tomorrow. This is our invitational, you know, this is the UC invitational, and, you know, we want to make our stamp. You know, we want to come out of it being the best team tomorrow, and we're going to have a chance of doing that. So we look forward to that challenge. Well, it's good. I mean, these are three teams we lost to last year. You know, Dayton we lost to, Xavier we lost to, and Ball State we lost to. And, you know, I challenged these girls, you know, really before we got started. It's like, you know, look, these are three teams that beat us last year. You know, let's see what improvements we've made as a team. And, you know, tennis is one of those sports. You, you, can, you can better yourself every single day. You know, if you have that attitude, every day is just a new opportunity. And, you know, I felt we've, we've made a pretty good stamp today. But, look, tomorrow's a new day. we got to wake up tomorrow in the right frame of mind. You know, probably might be a little tired, but, you know, everybody else is going to be in the same circumstances. We're going to be on our home outdoor courts tomorrow at Trabert Talbert, which is awesome. we got a great facility that – you know, with weather, we don't get a chance to use as much as we like. So, you know, we want to really finish strong tomorrow and, you know, really, you know, because it's, it's kind of the wrap-up for fall for a lot of these girls. We've got a couple girls going to the regionals next week. But for a lot of the team, you know, this is it. So we want to really make a good statement tomorrow.